Our first supercar location is the Pegasi Zentorno. This car comes almost fully customized when you find it and it comes in two colors, white with a green stripe or white with an orange stripe. There are three different places to find this car. This spawn location is inside the Pillbox Hill Garage as shown on the map right now. Here is a tip, if you want to find one of these cars in the video, drive to the location in a supercar. In doing so, you increase your chances of spawning this rare vehicle. In my case, I drove to this location in a T20. This car usually spawns during the day and not so much at night. And this is how it looks. The second spawn location for the Pegasi Zentorno is inside this West Vinewood garage as shown on the map right now. This car only spawns in this location at night. And this is how it looks. The third and final spawn location for the Pegasi Zentorno is by the Los Santos Customs in Burton. If you don't know where that is, it is shown on the map right now. This car usually spawns during the day and not so much at night. And this is how it looks. Our second supercar location is for the Garotti Turismo R. This car comes almost fully customized when you find it and it comes in two colors, red and black and matte red and matte tan. There are three different places to find this car. The first spawn location is inside the Pillbox Hill Garage as shown on the map right now. This car can spawn during the day and at night. And this is how it looks. The second spawn location for the matte red and matte tan Garotti Turismo R is inside this West Vinewood garage as shown on the map right now. This car only spawns in this location at night. This is how it looks. This is the third and final spawn location for the matte red and matte tan Garotti Turismo R and this is by the Los Santos Customs in Burton as shown on the map right now. This car spawns during the day and at night. And this is how it looks. Our 
Our third supercar location is for the Trafade Adam. This car comes customized when you find it and it comes in two different colors. White with a blue stripe and black with an orange stripe. There's only one location to find this car. The only spawn location for the Trafade Adder is in Rockford Hills beside the Little Crescent as shown on the map right now. This car can spawn either during the day or at night. And this is how it looks. Our fourth supercar location is for the Deboshi Massacre. This car comes absolutely fully customized and it is my favorite car by far. When you find it at one of these locations, it comes in one of two colors, either green with an orange pearlescent or midnight purple with a hot pink pearlescent. This car spawns at two locations. The first spawn location for the Deboshi Masaku that is green with an orange pearlescent is inside the West Vinewood Garage as shown on the map right now. This car only spawns at night. And this is how it looks. The second spawn location for the Deboshi Masakro that is midnight purple with a hot pink pearlescent is at the Los Santos Customs in Burton as shown on the map right now. This car spawns only during the day. This is how it looks. Our fifth supercar location is for the Dinka Jester. This car comes almost fully customized when you find it and it comes in two colors, chrome and this turquoise and yellow combo. There are three different places to find this car. The first spawn location is inside the Pillbox Hill Garage as shown on the map right now. This car can spawn during the day and also at night. And this is how it looks. The second spawn location is for the turquoise and yellow Dinka Jester, and this is found inside the West Vinewood Garage as shown on the map right now. This car only spawns in this location during the day. And this is how it looks. This is the third and final spawn location for the Chrome Dinka Jester, and that is by the Los Santos Customs in Burton, as shown on the map right now. This car only spawns during the day.
And this is how it looks. The next spawn location is for the Albany Alpha. The Albany Alpha spawns at the Los Santos Customs in Burton, as shown on the map right now. This car is usually fully customized and it is found inside the yellow square that is fully crossed out right beside the garage. And I found it during the day. And this is how it looks. Our seventh rare car location is for the Benefactor Dubsta that is fully chrome and also fully customized. It is located in the Los Santos Customs in Burton, in the yellow square that is crossed off right beside the garage. This car spawns only at night. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope this video helps you. If you have not already done so, please subscribe by clicking the button on the left inside the black box. And to watch my previous video, click the video on the right. Until next time, have fun in GTA 5 with your new cars.